Hello everyone, welcome to SciEase. In the last video, we discussed about the construction and working of human eye. I want to tell you one term, power of accommodation. This is a very important term. Sometimes only definition that is asked, what do you mean by power of accommodation? Eye lens that is made up of fibrous, jelly-like material. Its focal length can be changed by the ciliary muscles. Now when the muscles, they are relaxed, the lens becomes thinner and its focal length increases. This enables us to see the distant objects. On the other hand, when ciliary muscles contract, the lens becomes thicker and its focal length decreases and this enables to see the nearby objects. So what is power of accommodation? The ability of the eye lens to adjust its focal length, that is known as power of accommodation. So, power of accommodation is clear. Another term that is least distance of distinct vision, that is again important. Sometimes it's uh, this question is in the multiple choice that what is the least distance of distinct vision of human eye? 20 centimeter, 25 centimeter, 30 centimeter, 15 centimeter. So you have to take the correct one. So the minimum distance at which the objects can be seen most distinctly without any strain that is known as least distance of distinct vision. It is also called near point of the eye. And for the young adult with the normal vision, whose vision is completely normal, the near point is 25 centimeter. So in that multiple choice question, you will take 25 centimeter. The farthest point up to which the eye can see object that is called the far point of the eye and far point is infinity for the normal eye. So we can see, the normal eye can see the objects between 25 centimeters to infinity clearly. One thing I want to tell you, uh, when people, they become old, this eye lens becomes milky or cloudy. This results in the partial or the complete loss of vision. For that, surgery is there and this condition is known as cataract by changing the lens, by cataract surgery, the vision that can be restored. So this is all about power of accommodation, least distance of distinct vision, few terms. Now, in the next video, I will take up defects of human eye and how to correct those defects, how to remove those defects, that is very, very important topic. So we'll, I will take in the next video. Thank you.